swallowing mechanism which is fairly complicated reflux that generated with muscular and musculature structure. I want to explain you here how the food goes from mouth to the stomach. It's due to the swallowing mechanism. It's due to the swallowing mechanism. Why this mechanism is so important? Because the structure of the esophagus, the structure of the esophagus, which is composed of elastic tissues, these elastic tissues perform important role for taking food from one place to another place. Suppose we have a Suppose we have a mouth here and from the mouth the food goes from oral cavity from the mouth the food goes from oral cavity remember three phases in swallowing mechanism one is oral or buccal phase other is pharyngeal phase. Third is esophagus phase. These three phase are involved for the swallowing mechanism. Firstly, in oral, the food goes in the oral cavity and formation of bolus with the help of teeth. The movement of mouth form a bolus, the bolus which have a mucus, formation of bolus here. With the help of nerve sensation, the movement, motor activity, and then food goes into the pharyngeal region. The pharyngeal region actually perform an important role because in this region the food goes downward toward the esophagus region and from esophagus the food goes into the stomach look at why how the food transfer into the esophageal region near the esophagus epiglottis epiglottis moves toward the pharyngeal Downward moves down near the pharyngeal region, near the pharynx. When, mo when epiglottis moves move down toward the, near the pharynx, the food goes down. The food goes down. The swallowing mechanism in the esophagus, look at this type of me mechanism in the esophagus. And food transfer from one place to, an, to another place. Here, one, another continuously. So, so look at how the food goes toward the stomach. This is a mechanism of simply the, the explanation in front of you. Thank you so much, guys.